This video covers the setup and components of the PowerLift Pro from MLCS Woodworking. The first component we'll look at is the electronic control box or ECB. On the front there's a power indicator light and a shelf to hold your Android device. On the back are all the connections for the lift. Your power switch, your foot pedal, connections to the lift itself, your USB jack, and your power cord. The PowerLift Pro comes with a mounting arm to mount your ECB on your router table. The lower part of the mounting arm screws to your router table while the upper part inserts and gets held in place by a thumb screw. The first connection we'll make to the ECB is the AC power adapter. It simply plugs into the port on the back. All of the connections on the back of the ECB are unique so you can't plug something into the wrong place. The foot pedal plugs into the smaller round port and screws in tightly for a secure connection. The connections to the lift go into the larger round port and get locked into place with a threaded ring on the connector. The last connection to be made is the USB cord. It plugs into the remaining port on the back of the ECB. This recessed area on the back of the ECB is where the mount arm connects using two thumb screws. The upper part of the mounting arm fits right into the back of the ECB and gets screwed into place. The upper part fits into the lower part and gets held in place by a thumb screw. To tidy everything up, I zip tied all of the cords except for the USB cord down the mount arm. At this point, you can run the lift using the foot pedal. There are two pairs of unique plugs that connect the lift. Run the lift all the way down until it stops. There's a limit switch that will automatically stop the router lift when it gets to the bottom. At this point, it's time to mount the router. I've loosened the main carriage enough so that the router should slip in fairly easily. Once it's in place, I begin to tighten the carriage using the supplied Allen wrench. Later on in the process, we may have to make an adjustment to the position of the router in the lift, but for now, tighten it all the way up. You should orient your router so that nothing comes in contact with the bottom of the lift. The power cable should be facing away from the lift, and other items like switches need to clear completely. For this Porter cable router, I needed to have the switch in a certain position to clear the bottom of the lift but after I cleared it, I could use the switch in any position. MLCS sells a powerful 3 and a quarter horsepower router motor that fits perfectly in the lift without any obstructions. It's time to install the lift into the table. Disconnect the plugs and make sure that all the wires and cables go down through the opening in your router table. You'll have to orient the lift on a diagonal to get everything down through the opening. Once you have it in the opening, you can turn it and seat it into the recess. There's an upper limit switch which will stop the movement of the lift when contacted. There's also an adjustable bolt in the main carriage that you can use to fine tune that contact point. Adjusting the max travel of the lift is critical. On the left, we show a situation where the switch has already been contacted, but the top of the router is nowhere near the router plate. And on the right, the switch has not yet been contacted, but the router itself has run into the router plate. The ideal adjustment is to have the router just below the router plate when the switch is contacted. This will give you maximum accessibility to the collet. The PowerLift Pro has quick change insert rings, allowing you easy access to change bits. When the lift is lowered all the way down, there's 4 inch capacity between the top of the collet and the top of the router plate to handle even your tallest bits. To get the most from your PowerLift Pro, connect an Android device via the USB cable. You'll be able to move the lift in increments as small as one thousandth of an inch, perform preset movements, store lift positions, and so much more. For more videos on the PowerLift Pro and other great woodworking products, visit mlcswoodworking.com.